Hey, this is Blind Fox. Welcome to my little food review. Please support the channel. Please subscribe and please go and donate on Patreon.com. The link is in my on my channel page in YouTube. So today we are going to do a susati, more particular a cur a sweet curry susati. As I, I think the word has got a Malaysian origin. In English, it's called a kebab, I think. But in, Af in South Africa, you can get Susati in English as well. They use both names. I think originally, well, it's meat, pieces of meat on a stick. You get different flavors. You get chicken, you get beef, you get pork, you get, and you get so, sort of ch different flavors of it. But this particular one is uh, curry or sweet curry. You can see there little pieces of meat on a stick. You can eat it, either remove it from the stick and eat it like that or eat it from the stick. And I'm just using my hand to show you how easy it is to remove it. A sweet curry flavour. No real burn to this. Very oniony curry is quite nice. And you can see there there's some fat in there as well. If you don't have it, it um, can be a bit dry. This one I think is sheep, as far as I know. I know some people put, if they do a curry one, they put uh, dried peaches in it with the meat. Some people do other fruit. It's quite interesting. You can have a fruit society, that one you won't actually um, put on the fire. Oh yeah, this is of course done on a fire not in a pan or any other way or mostly you get something like um you get of course uh, vegetable ones you get quite the different ones but this one nice sweet curry sauce oh yes and then you brush it when you while you're cooking it with the sauce there's normally a lot of onion in there Curry, I'm not sure what else. Everybody has their own secret sauce. But the origin definitely, I think, is Cape Malay, seeing that it is a sweet curry normally. So this is a South African Susati. You can taste the um, slight char of the fire. You can taste the fire. Is The smokiness is, with, is combined nicely with the curry. It's quite nice. And of course, if you don't want your little sticks to burn, you can always wet your stick before. Well, they are actually wet because they are lying with their meat in the sauce. But what you can do is you can have your meat in your sauce, freeze it. And then when you're going to uh, do your susati, just put them on the, the little stick then. And you can always soak your stick in a bit of water first if, you, if you, it hasn't been lying in the curry sauce. So that your stick is slightly wet when it's um, put on the fire. It keeps the points from burning. So thanks for watching. Please support the channel. Please subscribe. Please go and donate on patreon.com and see you at my next ration review.